The one thing that Lucy and Ed have discovered is that wherever they are in the world, whatever it is that they're doing, they are at their happiest when they are together. I asked Lucy and Ed what it was about today that they were most looking forward to. Unanimously, the answer was spending time with all of you on what will be one of the happiest days of their lives. To have family that travelled so far to witness something so special. It's a day that is exclusively about Ed and Lucy, but it is a shared experience, which makes it even more meaningful. Love is a temporary madness. It erupts like volcanoes and then subsides. And when it subsides, you have to make a decision. You have to work out whether your root was so entwined together that it is inconceivable that you should ever part. Because this is what love is. Those that truly love have roots that grow towards each other underground. And when all the pretty blossoms have fallen from their branches, they find that they are one tree and not two. To you, Lucy, the day has finally come where we can finally enjoy the fruits of our labour. I'm so excited for our future together. Love you now and forever, Ed. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I told you this is what it would be because I left this in Chile. <laughs> Fantastic. Ed and Lucy, you've chosen to be together, you've chosen to build a life together, and you've chosen to bring your families together for this special occasion. Love is not an abstract concept, but a choice. Ed and Lucy, your love is very real, and I know that you chose one another. Now, you will say a few words that take you across the threshold of life, and things will never be quite the same between you. For after these vows, you will say to the world, this is my husband, and this is my wife. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. To seal my promises. To seal my promises. As you wear it, know that I love you. As you wear it, know that I love you. You are now my wife and partner for life. You are now my wife and partner for life. You are now my husband and partner for life. By the authority you have vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Kiss each other. guy in the world. But the truth is, I've been feeling like that ever since we first met at Work Drinks, where your attraction to five foot eight on a good day, half Chilean men soon became apparent. From that moment, our relationship gradually developed, starting off being long distance while we were still up in Yorkshire, to where we are today, and we eventually made a firm and genuine commitment to each other that remains unbreakable to this day. You always want the best for me, always push me to be better, and most importantly, I'm always the happiest when I'm with you. So when it came to the proposal, I knew it had to be something pretty special, which was the beautiful garden of Granny Margaret. 
when I finally did get down on one knee, no words came out of my mouth. But I feel like now I just stared at Lucy with big puppy eyes and held out the ring and was like, and she obviously said yes. Fortunately for me, she did. So here we are. And so I hope I've done a better job today conveying all my feelings and thoughts that I've had since I first met you. Lucy, I'm just so happy to be standing here today as your husband. I'm just so excited about the adventure of married life we have together. I love you, I love you, I love you.